Hey guys, welcome back to the channel review anything and everything. And today we are getting into an unboxing of this display stand for the Millennium Falcon set 75257. Link's link in the description is going to be below. So obviously I just finished building my uh, Millennium Falcon and purchased this stand to go with it because I feel that Millennium Falcon is one of those ships that even though it does have, you can lay it flat because it does have um, the mounts. Um, not the mounts, I'm sorry, the landing gear. But at the same time, it's definitely one of the widest sets out there. It's the widest set that I have of all the ships that I have. I have the Ghost, I have the um, Razor Crest, and I have the Onyx Cinder. And this is definitely the widest ship that I have. So um, putting it on a display at an angle, definitely suiting. Here you can see some of the things that I mentioned on here. It comes with two bags, pretty much made of Technic pieces. It comes with the instructions. So, I'm gonna put this together. It doesn't really say how, it's, let me see if it's gonna show how it actually stays on there. Um, I'm not seeing the example of it, so I'm hoping that I'm able to line it up correctly. Now they have uh, the photo on here, but I feel like because it's not in color, you, I can't really fully tell if the land. It looks like here that the landing gear is on top of that piece of the stand. So let's hope that that's the case and it actually works out that simple. So we're going to return back when it's built and I'm going to display the Millennium Falcon. All right, you guys, we are back and it is done. And it was certain parts of it were a little bit annoying to build. There's certain parts of it got a little easy. So um, link's going to be in the description, as I mentioned before, uh, it will, for the for the price of this, for you guys to purchase it. It's really not that much. I, th I can't remember what the price was, but I think it's no more than somewhere in that $20, $25 range. So I think it's worth uh, now. This part is a little funny because when you put this together here, the tension when you when you put this here, it's supposed to be able to go like this freely, but when you put it kind of too close together, the tension is hard to move. So just be careful with that because I had it like this and it stopped going forward because these parts were pressed in too much and they couldn't go around that, this piece right here. And then I thought something was wrong and I realized it just had too much tension going on inside of it. So that's that. Even now I can see it pinching at the top. So sometimes it makes it hard. Otherwise, it's not bad. It's not bad. A little rickety, but it's not bad. So essentially, what we do is we lay the uh, <clears throat> the feet of the uh, stands, the um, I'm sorry, landing landing gear down here. The other two will be sticking up that way, and you flip this over to kind of lock it in. So do that now. I'll put it sideways and let's see we can slide this in like this now everything should in theory align you see there and you just simply roll that up roll this one up so that way if you happen to lift it up it doesn't you know come loose but it's really just for preventative measures I wouldn't say lift it up while it's attached like this but Unless you see the Millennium Falcon on an angle, like it's flying, I think it's pretty good. So definitely recommend it. I definitely say that this is one of those models where it's great having a stand for because everyone's used to seeing it flying, especially at that angle. Everyone normally mentions that. Uh, who talks about this when you know when they have a stand for one of these um so it just looks great for display when you see it like that and your can is going to unfortunately be rolling all around but other than that um it's a great kind of setup for display i do wish that uh 
who knows that they started they probably do make stands for other ships like maybe the ghost and this and that um obviously it's got to go hand in hand with their stand mechanism this was customized to go with the uh landing gear for this set so anyway but that is a quick look at the building boat display stand for set 75257 millennium falcon as always you guys like share comment subscribe and i'll catch you guys